channel. So today's video is going to be my seasonal what's on my iPhone. I have finally switched it up for the holiday season and I want to show you all how I have my phone set up and like the backgrounds and just show you all that jazz. I love doing these videos. Um, so let's get into the video. Um, okay, so let's turn on screen record. I I love the way my phone is set up right now. It's probably one of my favorite my favorite setups that I have. So let me clear out all my stuff before I pop anything on. Okay, so I finally changed my screensaver on my lock screen and I changed it to this. Um, oh, I have gum, sorry. Is that annoying? And it's of me and Kenny Bear. We are, we were at the Apple Farm this fall. Um, and I do have the new iOS update. I believe it's the 16. So I finally like switched um, there. You're able to like put up these little widgets on your lock screen, which I think is pretty cool. So I changed the font a little bit and then I added these little three widgets. This one is the weather from left to right. It's the weather, my battery um, power. And then I just put my Google emails. Like if I get an email or something, I'll, I'll see it. And then down here at the bottom, it's the flashlight and um, the camera. I can ac easily access my camera. So that's cool. Um, I do need to charge my phone. I'm really, really bad at charging my phone. My husband gets on to me about it all the time, literally. Um, anyway, so if you flip up, this is the main um, screen and I switched up the widgets a little bit. I got um, all of the pictures on here are from Pinterest, just FYI. Um, oh, and the background I will say is from Pinterest as well. So the background is actually just a Christmas tree. I thought it was really cool. I was going for like a cool, like, um, dark like vampy kind of vibe um for this for this time around so i think i achieved it really well um usually i do like something bright but i really wanted to go dark this time so anyway so i on the widget um from on the left sorry um it's just like little cute christmas trees and it's like it's like a neutral dark vibe you got you feel me um and yeah i thought that was cute so i replaced that one and i went for more like a green color as well like a cool neutral tones um which is cool and then the other one before i go through all of the apps and stuff um i still have my favorite quote from Angelie cuthbert on there and then um down here i did like a like a i don't even know how you describe it like a um what's the word it's like a thin christmas tree <laughs> a charlie brown christmas tree um i did those at the bottom here anyways at the top nothing too crazy that's different on the layout i did kind of change it a little bit um from the last time but um as far as like organization wise like where all my apps and stuff those are pretty much the same um but up here i've got my social media app instagram youtube twitter i've been using twitter a little bit more I, usually i just i'm just not a twitter a twitter gal anymore pinterest love pinterest if you guys haven't followed me on pinterest um this is my pinterest here is this my pinterest yes it is um so love pinterest um this is a youtube app used to youtube studio app for um people who have like youtube make youtube videos you can see like your analytics and stuff on there um snap i don't use snap unless i'm snapping like amanda or something i just don't really use it tiktok i've been into tiktok lately um but this is my tiktok here if you guys want to follow me i just uploaded a video on there um or posted a video on there so you guys can check me out here um facebook and then messenger None of my Facebook or anything is like for public. I do have a public Facebook page, but I don't really post on it. So anyway, so photography, I've got my photos, camera, Visco, don't really use very much. Facetune and Lightroom are my most used apps on here other than like the photos and the camera apps. Um, and then scroll I'll use once in a while if I have like a bunch of pictures and I really want to show it off, but I want it to look cute. I'll put it on, I'll use the scroll app and then Canva. That's how I, I um, edit all of my YouTube YouTube thumbnails is on Canva. So you can do it on your phone and you can do it on, on your desktop, which is cool. Um, productivity, the most used apps on here is Notes and Amazon. <laughs> Other than that, I don't really use much. Shopkicks I'll use if I'm like walking into a, like a, a store or something and I wanna get points or something. I don't really scan barcodes anymore. Um, and then maps, obviously, I don't really, I don't use maps. I like Google Maps over maps. Unless you're out of the country. Like when I was in Europe this summer, maps was better than Google Maps, I found. So I keep, I keep them if I need 
one or the other for whatever reason finances won't go into that um lifestyle um most used app on here i've been trying to get into like to know it a lot of influencers are using that right now so i try to do that and then flip um flip is i won't really talk about it yet but something fun coming up with flip um is coming up pretty soon and i etsy i used etsy more so last year when i was wedding planning i just haven't really used it as much um lately but support small businesses etsy is awesome i love etsy i've never had one issue that I've, uh, from etsy um all of the vendors there have always been amazing shop small business all the way i would use etsy over amazon um entertainment all of these are very well loved on here um Right now, I've been do doing Disney since it's Christmas time. Um, I watch Disney Plus. Um, I started watching the Santa Clauses. I will have to say, if y'all have watched the Santa Clauses, how do you feel about them? I'm just not. I'm not feeling the fact that they're like, it's not a movie. And then I like how like the older char like the old characters are there now, but it's just not the same. It's definitely not the same vibe. But I'm gonna give it the benefit of the doubt and continue to watch it i'm only on the second episode so we'll see anyway um but disney plus and netflix i've been i've been using more so lately and then sorry another side side note um disney plus is going up so i definitely i'm going to be canceling my subscription because i don't use it other than the holiday times and i'll just get it back next year when i want to do that so fyi they're going up to 10.99 now so it was like 5.99 when i first started and then i think now i pay 7.99 and then they're going up to 10.99 like trying to turn into netflix um food apps instacart instacart is the most thing that's the most um app used on here and then chick-fil-a as well doordash and uber eats eh, not so much maybe if i'm like gone away for military purposes and i want to grab a bite to eat and i don't feel like like there's no transportation to get something to eat like outside of base or whatever i'll i'll use uber eats but in car i order usually nine times out of ten i order groceries i don't go grocery shopping anymore um apps what do i have on here oh prime video i don't really use so much on here candy crush kenny and i had like a candy crush thing going on like this past couple months he plays it still but i got bored and i don't play it as much either i got bored or i was a poor sport and he was beating me so he was like way past me on some level like i got stuck on a level for for like days and i'm like screw this <laughs> um travel app that is one of my most used folders ever you guys know i love 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 to travel got so many fun things coming up a lot of solo traveling i'm gonna be doing um and then some some you know trips that kenny and i have together coming up and a girl's trip coming up which is so fun next year i'm excited to show you guys and bring you all along with that but my travel app is awesome my most used app here it's definitely expedia um whatsapp i'll use when i'm like trying to talk to friends that are outside of the country um and then um yeah that's pretty much it. i don't really use airbnb or verbal as much unless i'm doing a group like if kenny and i are going in a group and we're all splitting in the airbnb um but yeah it's pretty cool and then uber uber and omeo omeo is awesome when you're trying to buy uh tickets or something like train tickets out of the country especially in europe i've only used it in europe so i don't know how it is like if it if they use it in asia or anything but omeo is definitely awesome I wonder if you can use Omeo in America. I'm gonna look that up when I get done. Anyways, um, but yeah, those are my, these are my favorite apps that I love to use. Um, I could talk about it for days, to be honest. Um, next app, music app. I use nothing in here. I used to use YouTube music a lot. Um, oh, it looks like they changed Apple music. It's just music now, but I don't, I don't use any of those anymore. I just have it because you can't even delete some of these things. So anyway work app nothing special there i got group me gmail mile iq i keep up with like my mileage like for work or something to write it off on my taxes later um but yeah this is all for work related stuff um extras um most used app on here calculator and the ring doorbell because my ring doorbell goes off pretty often during the day when people are crossing and it picks it up in front of our door um or if like we get a package or obviously if someone's at our door 
um, swipe again um, at the top this widget it says Kenny and I's wedding day this was our exit our sparkler exit um, below I have a widget of what is this trees Christmas trees and then a cute car with the Christmas tree on top I thought that was cute so I, I wanted to incorporate that FaceTime podcast I've been literally loving podcasts lately my favorite podcast um tell me sis podcast with alex and what's her name kyla sorry alex and kyla chintomos i've been loving theirs i've been getting into savannah chrisley's unlocked i've been loving their her podcast lately she just started a new one not too long ago who else have i been listening to that's more so those two like on podcasts i just don't feel like downloading apple podcasts but i did listen to a little bit of archetypes um uh, for megan markle I like I loved it. I only listened to one just because I didn't feel like downloading the Apple podcasting. I might have to download it because I want to listen to the rest of hers. But she had a really good um, first episode that I watched. Um, Google Map use that pretty often because I'm terrible with directions. Um, and then Clock I use these for you know obviously alarms and stuff. So um, and then everything else on here with Zillow we're not looking for a house anymore right now. So I don't really listen to that. Look at that Chrome. I usually use a Safari um, browser. Chrome I only use if I'm on my desktop, like my laptop, and like whatever I'm trying to access on my on my computer. If Chrome browser is better, is a better like for a website. If that makes sense. Um, like if Safari doesn't support the website as good as Chrome, I'll use that. Like military purposes, I use Chrome because Chrome supports military websites better. I don't know why. Um, weather app, I guess I use that pretty every day. And then this is just a settings button. And then um, I've got this really cute widget here on the side. It says Merry Christmas with two different types of Christmas trees. And also, if you guys can hear people in the background, I do apologize. Our maintenance people are, are working outside. Um, next, swipe again. And then I've got, I've got two widgets on the top here. And then I've got a clock. I, turned, I changed that color to red, the clock, and the um, calendar. Um, and then down here at this folder, I've got just... Oh, payment stuff. If I don't feel like paying for something or don't want to pay for something all together at once, I'll just break up the payments and pay it all there. Pay your zip in Klarna and your afterpay in Affirm things. This is not something you use to pay pay for something and then not pay it. Like, I pay it right back. Like, come on now. They get people who buy stuff and are like, oh, I'll just pay it later. And they really don't have the money to pay it later. That's not what it's for. Well, it is what it's for. It's for people, like, people who do things like that. But... I don't I don't do that I just do it because I'm like oh, I'll just break it up I prefer just to break up the payments but anyways productivity I use nothing on here <laughs> actually oh files I do use files um, and then widget smith once in a while zoom not so much during the pandemic definitely use zoom a whole lot um, I'll use google docs and google drive for work and then duolingo I've been um, brushing up on my français lately so I've been using that if you guys I don't think I've ever really talked about it but French is my second language. I know it. I know enough French to like survive and get around, but I just really wanted to brush up on my French. Uh, since next year, we're probably going to France, um, and or well, I'm going to France. Kenny's not going. <laughs> um, and I was in Belgium last or this past summer, and it literally it I carried everybody through Belgium um, because of all my years of French. Why are they screaming so loud outside? Jeez, I'm sorry um and then peacock i actually need to delete this because i don't use it anymore my free trial ran out um delete app um hello talk i don't really use but it's like a app that i use to talk to people in french so but yeah that's all of my apps you guys that's what's on my iphone right now all right thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and if you guys wanted wanted to um, access all of the screensavers I have my, on my phone, let me know. Um, send me a DM on Instagram. Um, and they, I think I may just start um, like having a Pinterest board or something so you guys go back to it um, and access it that way. That way I don't have to like keep it saved in my phone and you all can just go to it. You don't have to contact me about it. So yeah, just let me know. Thank you so much and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.